Alright, hello everybody, and welcome to another video today. My name is Chris, and today we're going to be taking a look at the soon to be former JCPenney department store located at the Oswego Plaza in Oswego, New York, and it was just announced yesterday that this JCPenney department store uh, would be shutting down. After dodging the axe rep repeatedly over years, and even as the department store struggled in the in the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic, caused its owner to seek bankruptcy protection, the J.C. Penney store in at the Oswego Plaza in Oswego, New York, would be closing. An employee confirmed on Monday that the store in the Oswego Plaza off State Route 104 on the city's east side would close, but referred further questions to J.C. Penney corporate media relations team, which did not respond to an email Monday seeking comment. It was not clear when the store would close or how many employees would be affected. As of recently in 2020, the Oswego store workforce in, uh, employed around 40, including six to eight full-time positions. Most customers on Monday had no idea that the store was closing and said the closure would be disappointing. I've always liked the store very much, said Bob Nolan as he left the store after returning several pairs of pants that were the wrong size. I'm sorry that they're closing. Although Nolan did not did not be, had not been to the Oswego store in a couple of years, he said it became the closest store to his Liverpool home after J.C. Penney and Destiny USA closed. He wasn't sure where he would do his shopping in the future. That's a shame, he said. I don't know why they can't stay open. Cherry Snyder of Oswego also was not sure what she would do without the store, which she shops at pretty frequently. This is the biggest store we have for clothes, she said. Uh, Snyder who was on her way to JCPenney to look for some boots and clearance items, said she d does not shop online very much, but would probably have to rely more on online shopping in, in the future. She likes JCPenney for its discounts, which she said are important at a time when prices for necessities like food have soared. Um, so this just goes on about the history of JCPenney, the decline, the recession. This is all just basic fluff. Um... Wasn't they weren't surprised that the store was closed? Um, this store was actually supposed to close, but it received a last minute and stayed open. Um, they're just gonna have to find some place. They're saying it's very sad. So the Oswego J.C. Penny. This is very sad that this store um, is going to be closing. Um, so my guess was employees were either informed yesterday or they were informed last week. But this looks like a couple trickle of J.C. Pennies because. Uh, just a few days ago, it was announced that J.C. Penney in Indiana, which was connected to a mall where it is the last department store, is closing as well. So I'm guessing that this does not come as a surprise. Uh, hopefully, the employees that are currently working at the store are getting their cover letters and resumes ready to go, as they will most likely have to apply uh, for another job um, a couple of months down the road. And the liquidator for this store, as you guys know, it's pretty obvious, SP360 Capital Partners LLC uh, will be responsible for the liquidation at the JCPenney store in Oswego, New York. So anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video. Link to the article will be located in the video description below of this video. And what are your guys' thoughts on this JCPenney store closing? Please let me know in the comment section below. So Anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video. Link to the article will be located in the video description below, and that will be it.